Welcome back, everyone. During our month in Drake, Colorado, we rode the Estes Park Aerial Tramway. We're Steve and Kathleen. We're cruising America in our 35-foot fifth-wheel RV, chasing 70-degree weather year-round. If you'd like to watch our previous videos, please click the Cruising America playlist link in the description below this video. Otherwise, enjoy our current episode starting now. Our main attraction while staying in Drake, Colorado is Rocky Mountain National Park. Because of Wuhan virus, the National Parks instituted a timed entry pass system as an additional social distancing measure. When we planned our trip last February, the initial block of passes were already available and sold, but Rocky Mountain National Park held back a block of passes that would become available at 5 p.m. the day before. We've been good about getting our next day's passes, but while visiting Sprague Lake, we also took a shot at seeing moose, which meant passing over the summit to the West Side Valley, which is the headwaters of the Colorado River. This also meant we missed our opportunity to get a timed entry pass for the next day. One of the great things about spending one month in each location is the ability to adjust our schedule. We did just that by riding the Estes Park Aerial Tramway instead. Designed and built by Robert Heron, he became involved with tramway projects during World War II. The Army's 10th Mountain Division contracted the engineering company Mr. Heron worked for to design a portable tramway for use in Italy and Germany. After the war, Mr. Heron studied more tramways. Because of the steep terrain, many trams in Europe do not require any towers to support the wire ropes. The entire length is a free span between the bottom and top stations. The Estes Park Aerial Tramway utilizes this design. A free span is fairly uncommon in the United States, and this type of design affords a very smooth ride. Mr. Heron also became one of the pioneering chairlift builders for the United States ski industry and built the first double chairlift in this country. The Estes Park Aerial Tramway opened to the public in July of 1955. Since then, it has safely carried more than 3 million people to the summit of Prospect Mountain.